What's up everybody? Chris with South Carolina Gun School and I've got a surprise today. We're gonna to be talking about Mantis Blackbeard X. <laughs> we're gonna be talking about the Mantis Blackbeard X which you can use with your AR to practice some of your dry fire um, I had the great pleasure of winning this out at the NOC train and learn event so huge shout out to Kevin Dixie thank you very much uh, and also huge shout out to Grant Lassard over with Mantis X uh, thank y'all very much. Uh, this has been an absolute pleasure to work with a little bit. So now I'm going to let everybody know the great things about this. Uh, this right here is another way to step up your training to the next level. Yes, this is mainly for dry fire. Uh, they have other options uh, which you can attach to your AR to get some statistics and see how you're doing with your live fire practice as well. Uh, but this thing is just freaking awesome because you get to use your platform. So you're not having to change platforms or anything like that with some of the other training tools out there and not taking anything away from those tools, but this is something where you get to use your platform, your setup to do your practice. All right, so we're gonna kind of slide the box out of the way here. It comes with this great case. All right, and we'll go ahead and unzip it. And then you get to see what you got in here. So you got your instructions up here at the top, uh, comes with, your charging cable and then there is also a little Allen wrench somewhere in the mix ah here it is comes with your tool uh, so you can adjust your windage and elevation uh, yes it does have windage and elevation adjustments so we'll go ahead and take that out here's your bolt so you pull out your charging handle your bolt and you put this in place of it and up here at the front I don't know if you can see these little holes. That's where you will adjust your windage and elevation. Uh, the little lever here is the laser coming on on the trigger press or the, the down is laser stays on. So it's on all the time. Again, up is the laser comes on with your trigger press. So, I mean, this thing is just freaking awesome. Then of course you have the magazine that goes up into your magazine here's your charging port up here it is a micro USB charging port so if you have uh, other charging ports uh, with the micro USB you can use those with this okay you get up to 100,000 trigger presses per charge 100,000 trigger presses per charge you get up to 10 trigger presses per second all right this telling you, this thing is awesome. Now, price point, it's not that bad, $320. I think that is a very fair price point uh, for what you're getting here. Also on top of that, you only have to pay for the hardware. The software is totally free. Some of these places you gotta pay for the hardware and for the software. This, you're only paying for the hardware. All right, the software, can download onto your phone, your tablet, your computer, wherever you'd like to have it, Mantis X, right there. There you go, it pops up and it asks you to connect. So let's go through, and it's very simple. As you can see, we have a clear rifle. All right, always make sure the rifle's clear. Pop out your back pin, lay it over, pull out your bolt, drop out your charging handle. All right, and then this will just slide right in there, just like that, see? Slides right in, lock 
it in, lock your pin in. Down here at the bottom, this is your lever to turn it on. Press and release it. You should see a little blue light. All right, there's a blue light lighting up. That's letting you know it's ready to be connected. You go ahead and slap it in there. You kind of hear it start to set itself up. Go over to the software on your phone here. Oop, got to enable Bluetooth. So that's other things. Bluetooth's got to be enabled. Um, come back over after you enable it, hit connect, scanning, connecting, bam. And then there you go. There's everything that it pulls up. You have tons and tons of options in here. Okay. The, the amount of data that you can get from this thing is phenomenal. So you've got on target delay score. So pretty much how long it's taking you to go from your ready position, wherever it might be, to on target. Then you have over travel. All right, so when you're driving to your second target, if you go past it and have to come back, that's what the over travel is doing for you. All right, then you have transition path. So that transition path should be a straight line. So that's what it's showing you. It's showing you if there's any wave movements up, down, left, right, whatever, on depending on how you're transitioning. That's your transition path. All right, then you have comparisons where you can go in and compare what you've been doing and how you're progressing. All right, the next thing you have is your drill settings. So you can go in and change your settings, your start time uh, if you're running a timer. Uh, so the start time on the beep, your par time. So if you want to beep to start, beep to stop, you've got all kinds of settings you can go in here and change. The next thing you have is heat trace. All right, what the heat trace is, is essentially how fast you're moving. So it kind of shows you how quickly you move to your target and where you're slowing down to come into your target or if you're going too quickly past it, having to come back, that's all part of that over travel. So that's what that heat trace is showing you is how quickly you're moving to your target, where your slow spots are, either coming off the target, going on to the target and things like that. Then the last thing you have is your phase times. So your phase time is essentially how quick, how do I describe this? The phase times is how you're, after the shot breaks, how quickly are you getting off target and on to another target? All right, I, I don't know if that's, if I didn't explain that correctly, I apologize. You can definitely go into their website and actually read about all of the different types of options that you have, but I'm pretty sure that's to me about the best way to describe it. So if I'm on target, you can actually, I'll flip it off safe and you can hear it. It resets the trigger for you. So it's resetting the trigger for you. All right, but essentially the phase times is I fired on the target and it's showing me how quickly I got off of that target moving to my other target. So like I said, the amount of data that you get with this is absolutely ridiculous. Again, it is your platform, your gun. There's no modification. You take out the bolt, take out the charging hander you put theirs in. You're not having to modify anything else on the gun, okay? Uh, I was asking, when they were talking about this product, I was asking about using it with the laser software. If some of y'all are familiar with it, uh, great. Uh, yes, you can use it. You get the option of red, green, or infrared with this. Okay, and it does work with the laser software or anything else that you might use. Laser, L-A-S-R, all right, not L-A-S-E-R like the actual laser. Uh, it's called Laser, L-A-S-R. Um, it's great software to use. Uh, it's been a great training tool for me, uh, and it's something I've even incorporated in my classes as well, too. That's another great thing about this. If you're an instructor, you can incorporate this into your classes. Because I do some dry stuff with newer students before we move out onto the range and start doing live fire. So this is something you can incorporate in your training. Um, let's pull the software back up here. 
Uh, so yes, you got open training, shot timer, par timer, shoot, no shoot, Mantis X benchmark, time benchmark, compressed surprise break, secondary is primary, kneeling, reload drills, cadence drills, hostage rescue drills, USMC qualification. You've got groups that you can join. And they've got little things uh, like little sort of competition things that you can do amongst the groups or amongst a group of people that you set up. You can set up your own groups. This stuff is awesome. Right on your phone, right here on your phone. There's your groups, here's your settings. There's your groups where you can go and add, jump into a group, here's your history. All right, it shows the history of your training and everything. Then we'll go back over here to train, transition, plate. All right, we're just gonna do the shot timer. Okay, confirmed. Everything's set up so you'll hear it beep once I hit start on when I need to go. Shooter ready. Safe. We'll do stop. So our average score was 37.1, total time was 7.9. Um, best one was a 95.5, 84.6. Okay, let's look and see what it's saying. So, the issues that I'm having is telling me my support hand pushing. So, it, it breaks everything down right here for you. I mean, it's, it's awesome. Then you have your uh, trigger press movement, hold movement. You've got your little graphs and stuff there for that. All right. And then see, here's kind of like your, when you're getting into your transition pass, uh, heat trace, uh, over travel, all that stuff. I mean, it's, it's freaking just awesome. Like each shot, see it's breaking down. That's shot 18, shot 17, 16. See, I didn't have quite a straight line there. All right, so that's that transition path. I'm telling you, the amount of data that you're getting from this is just phenomenal. Uh, the other uh, pieces of hardware they have are what you would use uh, with the live fire, and you can kind of stick it anywhere on the gun that you want to. You can stick it on the side of the magwell. It's just a little sticky piece that sticks on the side of the magwell. Back here somewhere else on the lower, uh, the butt stock. I mean, there's all kind of different options that you've got with that, but this is mainly dry fire. Again, it works with your platform. Safety y'all, bang, bang, here we go. Let me go. And that's just, just me just sitting here kind of playing around. I'm sure that would probably change if I actually got up in my stance got ready and actually started working. But I wanted to go over this to show everybody there are phenomenal options out there. I know I've done a previous video talking about the shot timer. This is everything all in one. You got your shot timer here with your software on your phone, tablet or computer. You got your hardware in your platform and you're ready to go. So please folks, if you're looking to step up your training, this is the tool here. You're not gonna go wrong, you're not gonna be disappointed. I just read to you all of the amount of data that you're getting from this thing. So now, I'm not saying this is gonna be the end all be all. This does not mean you don't still need to go out and get some more formal training, all right? This is a great tool to use in between those formal training sessions, all right? This is something I'm definitely getting ready to step up my game and I'm start adding in, because I'm curious about transition path to over travel the phase times heat trace all that stuff that's something you don't not saying that that an instructor wouldn't be able to help you with that stuff but to be able to see it there on the phone and be able to like correlate it to actual statistics and numbers is is awesome um the other stuff is just kind of feelings and you'll have to go and take a class with uh, Trayvon Barber if you want to talk about feelings and stuff when it comes to guns, all right? 
I'll have the link down in the description so you can go in there and check it out and read more info about all of the options that you have to be able to track with this software. Again, huge shout out and thank you to KD with No Other Choice, Kevin Dixie, uh, Grant Lassard with Mantis X. This is much appreciated. There's going to be a lot more videos coming out with me using this and kind of showing how I'm progressing and everything. So be on the lookout. We have other great videos coming. Please continue to like, share, comment, subscribe, support. It is much, much appreciated. We've got great, great stuff coming, especially in the next video. I've got a nice little surprise for everyone. This is it's going to be an awesome, awesome thing. It's another thing that I had the pleasure of winning out at Train and Learn. Uh, so if you're an instructor or somebody in the industry, you want to step up your game, Train and Learn is where you need to be. All right, Atlanta, Georgia, 2024 is where it's going to be. Get in there and get signed up. Matter of fact, I'll even have the link. If you want to go in and look about the description and get signed up, I'll have a link down there below. Thank you very much to Core Essentials and also No Other Choice. We're affiliates with them. We've got promo codes, their information and links and stuff, and promo codes are all down in the description. Get over there, get you some gear, get you a discount. And always remember, folks, if you're not shooting, you're reloading. If you're not reloading, you're fighting. If you're not fighting, you're dead. Train to live. See you on the range.